Technology and landscape has rapidly changed since my childhood. Unfortunately, the representation of women in business has not kept a pace as what the speed of technology has. Marnie, I agree with you. I don't think that the representation um, has kept pace with the rate of change. Technology is shaping the world we live in, and yet challenges for women in tech industry still persist up to this point. We really can't deny that it is still a male-dominated in STEM's career. But to close the gap, we should be inspiring more women to pursue a technology degree in the higher education. If women uh, can see women like them being promoted to leadership roles, this will encourage them to uh, consider and choose a career in the tech sector. Women want to work in an environment in which they can thrive. Uh, CISPRA has a, a number of women in key uh, leadership roles across the globe, and these female role models are very important to encourage more women to enter the tech sector. I believe we need to change uh, how society uh, perceives our industry and prove technology is not strictly the world for men. We need uh, role models who can inspire, uh, motivate and encourage more women in technology as well as young girls and college students as they come along. Just with um, what Josephine said, if you can't see it, you can't be it. You know, young women need to see women like them being promoted and doing the things that they want to do in the tech sector. I completely agree uh, with, with all my colleagues and I think that the advice I can give for any aspiring young, young woman wanting to enter leadership is to truly follow your heart, follow your passion. Diversity generates more revenue. According to a study, Fortune 500 companies with at least three women in a leading position, they will see a 66% increase in the ROI and have a purchasing power of an estimate of $5 trillion. It has been proven repeatedly that uh, with more women in the workforce and leadership teams lead to better innovation and improve financial performance. Women have more empathy, which leads to success in uh, people-facing roles, but also product development, developing products with people in mind. Um, you know, technology, it's a great career. It moves fast. There's always something new to learn. You can be technical, you can be creative, you can be people-focused. But the better the diversity, the better the ideas. Completely agree. Embracing workplace diversity benefits everyone. It's not just women, but the whole organisation. We need to embrace diversity. We need to embrace uh, difference of opinion, um, different perspectives, different experiences. Um, everyone's got a different point of view. And it's only when we collectively come together with all those, uh, that fusion, is it that we can build thriving and high-performing teams. I think sponsorship is important in breaking the bias. Women need access to mentors and networks so they can um, see how they can move up in an organisation and move ahead in their careers. Each and every one of us is responsible for our own actions, for our own thoughts, which means we are responsible for calling out biases, for addressing and breaking down barriers to inequality rejecting discrimination and smashing the notion of stereotypes. We need men to support women and women need to support women too. So we must work together, uh, look for one another and a correlation and in order to achieve equal opportunity. My wish for the future is to empower young women and girls with information and role models that will encourage them to seek new create new ideas uh, and new careers. Um, and also 50% representation in decision-making rooms around the world. My wish for the future is that I hope I can inspire many, if not at least one young lady to take a leap of faith and invest in herself and do what makes her truly happy. Um, my wish for the future is to have every single woman to have a better and higher education. Remember, knowledge is power. With power, you young lady 
can change the world. Make the world a better place for you and me.